Hello, today we're looking at the book Pumpkin Soup. I like making soup. What's your favourite soup? I think uh, my favourite soup is tomato soup and I do like and I think I make a mean <gasps> carrot and coriander soup. And this book is by Helen Cooper. And we have a story about three friends and here they are in their little home. Looks really sweet, doesn't it? And they're enjoying a singing and dancing and playing. <gasps> oh, we've got bagpipes and guitars. <gasps> wow. But apparently they make a really good soup. <gasps> Pumpkin soup. The best you've ever tasted. Made by cat who slices up the pumpkin. Made by squirrel who stirs in the water and made by duck who scoops up a pipkin of salt and little bit of curry, I think that's all, and tips in just enough. Oh, there they are, look, stirring their soup. Right, so, oh, we are going to make, shall we have a pretend? We're going to pretend, we're going to mime making some pumpkin soup. So first of all, we need to look out. Let's go outside, open your door. Oh, let's have a look. Which pumpkin shall we have? There looks a nice big juicy one. They can be quite heavy though, and they're round. Oh, that's it, you got it round. Oh, big pumpkin soup. Oh, oh move out the way. Oh. Move my spoon to. Wow, so we have our pumpkin. Ooh, what was the first thing? We better give it a clean, haven't we? Wipe it round, show me the shape. That's it, give it a wipe all the way round. Super. Now, what did Cat do? <gasps> Slice it. Oh, watch out. Make sure if you really did this, you'd get some help. <gasps> oh, it's a big chunk knife. Can you show me how you slice? Slice. And that's it. Are you good at chopping? Chopping and cutting up. Chop, chop, chop. Slice some more. Ooh, watch out. Has lots of pips in the side. So let's scoop out those pips and put those to one side. Right, okay. Get those pieces and put them into your pot. Ooh, here's my pot. There we go. That's it. Put it all in. Ooh, right. We've got lots of pumpkin slices to put in there. Super. Right, what was next? <gasps> some water. Right, we need some water. <gasps> Get your jug of water. Okay, let's pour it in. Pour it really carefully. Don't splash it. That's it. Let's have a look. Is that enough? Let's try and give it a stir and let's have a see. Give it a stir and stir and stir it round. Hmm, I think it needs a little bit more water. Are you ready? Let's pick it up. Pick up the jug. Pour some more water on. Oh, it's looking nice. <gasps> what was the other thing? <gasps> a pipkin of salt. So a little bit of salt. Let's find some salt. Oh, we might have a shaker or you might have a pinch. Let's pinch, shall we? Let's sprinkle it in. Let's have a look. Oh, let's stir it and see. Stir it round and round and round and have a taste. I think it needs a little more salt. Let's put a bit more in. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. And stir. Right, we need to put it on the hob, don't we? So you put it on the hob. And look, turn it up. Let's have a listen. Oh, it's starting to bubble. Bubble and bubble and bubble. Oh, quick stir and some more. Stir and stir and stir. And let's do a little tiny. Oh, I need to blow on it now. It's got really hot. Are you ready, blow? Not too hard, but it doesn't go everywhere. Let's try it again. Really careful. Oh, that is hot. Oh, really hot. You didn't burn your tongue, did you? Oh, I hope not. Let's try it again. Mmm, yum, yum. That tastes really yummy. <gasps> Fantastic, give it another stir. <gasps> oh, that will be nice to have with our lunch later. Mmm. <gasps> Let's have a look a bit more at the story. Now, they liked taking turns, didn't they, in our story? 
and they would slurp. <sighs> we slurping. We pretend to have your your soup. And they played songs and they popped into it and they were very happy until <gasps> one morning. Duck woke up early and tiptoed into the kitchen. He smiled. There we are. Look. <gasps> What's he doing? He didn't want to do the salt anymore. He wanted to stir. <gasps> oh, but the others said no. Oh my goodness. Look at them squabbling. My goodness me. <gasps> they didn't want to take turns in having a go. Cat was like, that's my thing. I do the stir, the cutting. And someone, oh, it was a uh, squirrel said, I do the stirring. Oh my goodness. I'm not staying here, <gasps> whale duck. Oh my goodness, look, he's going away. <gasps> He'll be back, stormed cat. Oh dear. Do you think he did come back? <gasps> not for breakfast, <gasps> not even for lunch. I'll find him, scoffed cat. He'll be hiding outside. Oh, look at the big pumpkins. No, he didn't find him there. He couldn't find him anywhere. Squirrel and cat started to get a bit worried. Oh, I'm sure he'll be back. No, oh look, how are they feeling now? They're feeling really, really sad. The soup wasn't tasty. Oh, it's because they didn't have their friend there. Oh dear me. He was only trying to help, wept the cat. Let's go out and look for him. <gasps> there they are. Oh no, <gasps> I hope he's not in trouble. <gasps> oh my gosh. They're very scared to go into the dark wood. <gasps> they couldn't find him. Oh no. <gasps> then they start to think, what if something terrible has happened to him? <gasps> Maybe he's fallen off a cliff or fell down a well. <gasps> something terrible. Oh, they were getting worried now. Ha <gasps> ha. Then Cat whispered in a little sad voice, Duck might have found some better friends. He might, yelped the squirrel. Friends who let him help. Oh, now they're feeling bad about not letting him have a turn at something different. But when they were almost home, they saw a light shining in the cabin. There it is. It's Duck! And there he was. And Duck was so pleased to see them. Oh, and he was very hungry. Hmm, what shall we make? What do you think they're going to make? Yes. Oh my goodness. Some pumpkin soup. Right. Do we think Duck's very good at Stirring. Oh, it's gone everywhere. When we stirred out did it nice and carefully, he splashed it around. Oh, oh, oh. But, oh my word, look at this. <laughs> oh, they didn't say a word. <clears throat> Not even when Duck stirred the soup so fast that it slopped right out of the pot. Not even when the pot got burnt. Then Duck showed Squirrel how to measure out the salt and the soup still the best you've ever tasted. So once again it was peaceful in the old white cabin until Duck said, I think I'll play the bagpipes now. Oh, <laughs> oh dear, mm -mm. <coughs> what will they have to think about? Maybe let them have a go? Friends, really important. I know, let's have a think. Let's make a friendship soup. What would you put in yours? Ooh, I've got a recipe here. It says it's a friendship recipe. Right, let's see if I can follow this recipe. Right, see if you can help me. You might think of your own to make. A pinch of love. Ooh. Let's get this packet. A pinch of love. Sprinkle that, that's it. Put that in there. A handful of care. Okay, let's get that there. Let's get that up. 
mindful of care. A spoonful of forgiveness. Yeah, it's really important to forgive each other, isn't it? Like when ducks spilt the soup everywhere, they didn't say anything. It was okay, they forgave him for that and burning in the pot. So let's have a look. So that was a spoonful. Right, let me get pretend. A spoonful. Yep, and pop that in. That makes it good. <gasps> a heap full of happiness. Ooh, a heap full of happiness. Let's get this one here. Right, I think we'll use the spoon again. Real heap full, this full. <gasps> oh, that's it. A heap full of happiness. Yeah, it's nice to be happy with our friends, isn't it? And, oh, a sprinkle of kindness. Oh, I like that. Let's shake it. Let's shake it. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. That's it. Oh, and a jug full of of oh, understanding. What does that mean? Understanding. I think that means looking at things from someone else's point of view. Right, let's get that jug and pour it in. That's it. Oh, I think we better give it a stir. That's it. With our nice friendship spoon, give it a stir. Right. Do you think that would make a good friendship spoon? soup what might you put in to make a good friendship what ingredients would you use mmm nearly there might need a little bit of extra of something else <gasps> patience we do need patience and maybe a little bit of sharing could go in there let's see what soups you can come up with and I hope you have a really good friendship soup.